Hello, hello. Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, welcome to the channel. If you don't mind hitting that like button, subscribe, comment, I'll reach back out to you. So today's topic is, can overfilling your engine be bad? And I mean overfilling your engine with oil. Can it be bad? The answer is yes. Can it blow out seals and all that good stuff? Yes. Yes, it can. And we're going to go over why that happens. And you figure overfilling your engine, it would be a good thing because you get extra lubrication. Well, that's actually wrong. You get less lubrication. And the reason that is, is because um, if it's over full and the crankshaft is actually dipping into it, the crankshaft actually whips the oil. And when you whip the oil, it creates a foam. And... You don't want foam. Foam is pretty much aerated. Or aerated. And the flow can actually slow down or stop the flow of oil if it's over full too much. So the crankshaft's spinning pretty fast and it's whipping up that oil. Think of it like you whisking an egg or something with a, with a, a, a whisk. Um, don't, doing the same thing. It can cause your gaskets or seals to fail. And that goes back to the crankshaft dipping it in there and creating air and foam, when you enter air into the system, um, it makes the pressure increase inside the crankcase. Uh, gaskets, and seal, excuse me, gaskets and seals are designed to withstand a certain amount of pressure. Um, when you overfill it and you increase the pressure, it can blow out seals. We're talking about rear main seals, uh, head gaskets, front seals, um, basically uh, oil st um, valve stem seals it can blow out and some of these seals are very hard to get to so just put it at the full mark you know you, you check it after it's been running you know um, spark plug fouling if it's over full enough it could actually get into the combustion chamber and it can foul out your spark plugs and you'll know you'll get a blue tint smoke coming out of the tailpipe you may smell oil um, so too much of it leaking in there it'll actually get onto the spark plug the spark plug will try to burn it but if it gets caked on there then the spark plug can't get the voltage it needs I guess you could say and it cannot the spark can't jump the gap and actually burn everything off and when that happens then you have excessive um, oil leak or it's excessively over full and that could actually be catastrophic to the exhaust system because once it gets into the combustion chamber and the spark plug can't spark anymore, you're going to get misfires. It's going to run rough. It may not start. You're going to get blue smoke. And if it gets bad enough, it can actually make it out of the combustion chamber and it'll go into the exhaust. It'll get pushed into the exhaust. And most of it will burn out if the vehicle's still running. It may be misfiring. Um, most of it will burn out. Like I said, you'll get the, the exhaust, the blue smoke in the exhaust. But in extreme cases, it can actually clog up your catalytic converter. And catalytic converters are not cheap. Um, so your best bet is like when you do your oil change, you know, look in your owner's manual to see how much oil your vehicle takes. And you want to put it, if it's a hash mark or if it has a full mark or anything like that, you want to put it right at the full mark. In between just means you're safe. It's... And then you got the low, which is the low end. So that's not good either because higher RPMs, engine spinning faster. But to bust some of those myths out there, can overfilling my engine with oil cause oil seals to leak, cause them to blow out, uh, cause misfires? Yes. Yes, it can. Um, it's already tight tolerances in there. And when it's over full and the crankshaft's dipping in there and creates and it gets air in the system, which increases pressure which therefore seals go poof and now you got a bigger problem so i hope that answers your question i thank you for stopping by the channel i hope you continue to stop by the channel and i will talk to you guys later and i'll see you on the next one and i love you all